It's never a dull moment in our lives. Yo, I can't believe that they showing sister was kidnapped, escaped, and now she got to prove her identity. Damn. Picture that. Yeah, it is crazy. And all I could think about is that they were trying to kidnap me. And I feel horrible about it. Like, why do people want to keep hurting us? Hey, I, I, I think about the same thing. It's, it's horrible, man. You know, I don't want to worry or nothing, but I think we may need to, you know, get some security around here. You know, and I even set up an appointment to get some security cameras. I'm not trying to take this lightly. Yeah, you shouldn't. I mean, just the thought of losing you is really frightening to me. So have you talked to Richard? <sighs> nah. It's been hard to get a hold of him, you know? It's like everything good in his life is just crashing down. I can say I can relate to that. Yeah. And I talked to Rachel and she's been big about everything that's been going on. Mm -hmm. You know, and all she says is that Richard moved and left her with the kids. Yeah. And I tried to set time aside to talk to her about the business and the church and she just keeps canceling on me every time. Honestly, I don't even know how much longer the business and everything else is going to be able to stay afloat. Babe, listen, all that energy, money you put into that business, it's going to work out. Yeah. I mean, that's with or without her. But maybe we should, you know, plan a surprise dinner or something. You know, invite them both individually and help them out with their marriage. Okay. How about we mind our own business and figure out a way to finally get married? Come on, we put off getting married long enough. I mean, shoot, I'm almost to the point of just going to the justice of peace and become illegal. Babe, you don't want to do that. Whatever. No, you don't want to do that. You got to understand it's hard right now. My mom moved in with us because my aunt don't want to see her face. <laughs> my brother Richard, he's absent from the church. He's depressed. I mean, and Reggie, who knows where he's at? Come on, babe. All right, but Ray. When am I going to be first? I mean, I've been second for so long, I don't even know where my place is anymore. Sometimes I wonder if it's even worth it. Hello, this is Roberta. Hello, Ms. Armstrong. This is Phil, your condo attendant. I have a potential buyer that want to look at the condo, and she's only going to be in town this evening. So, um, you think you can, you know, swing by over here with the keys so we can um, let her in and look at the um, the condo? Oh, hey, Phil. Sure. Um, can you give me about 20 minutes to get dressed, and then I'll be <laughs> right over. All right. Thank you. All right. See you soon. Okay. Thank you. Played that very well. You don't have to worry. Cause I ain't gonna kill you right now. But you have to go to sleep for a minute. from the condo association. Okay. He's been handling, showing people, sorry, the buyers from my condo. So he doesn't have access to the keys, so I have to go and drop them off to him. No, honey, I'm okay. I'm just gonna go ahead and drop the keys off and I'll be right back in there. That's it. Don't be looking at me. Man, I need you to stay with me. <laughs> yeah, I bet. Well, do you want me to bring you back something to snack on? I need you to come back so I can snack. <laughs> <laughs> you so nasty. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, I will be back soon. Okay. Wait, quickly. Hmm? Oh, yeah. Mm. You will be giving me something when I get back. <laughs> quickly. Okay, okay. 
Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Hello? Hello? Phil? Hello? Roberta, <laughs> don't scream. Don't scream. I'm going to take my hand down, but I want you to remain calm, okay? Okay? Please let me go. Don't, 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 don't fight me, okay? Don't fight me. I would never hurt you. I would never hurt you. Let me explain, okay? to explain and then I'm calling the police. Talk! Don't, don't call the police. But, wow. You look amazing. You did one minute. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, okay. But you walked in and it's like a breath of life just came with you. You know, it is hitting. It's popping. Really. But let me focus. Okay, I was sent to break you and Raymond up. That's all. That's what it was. That's what I was called to do. That's it. If that was true, how did you end up in San Juan beating up on Daniel who you thought was me? I was sent to San Juan to break up your relationship with Raymond, but also to blackmail him for money. I never intended to hurt anyone, you or Danielle. <laughs> but you fell for me, right? <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, so, um, you were paid to destroy my relationship. You know, but you, but you fell in love with me, right? You have got to understand, I never wanted to hit you. Even when I was doing it, I said, I don't want to do this, I don't want to hurt you, and I even explained to you how I felt for you. But now I understand why you don't know, because it wasn't you, it was Danielle. Yeah, okay. So, God, I can't believe this is happening. It's okay. I fell in love with you, and I still love you. All those times when we were spending together, I just, just, it just wound up coming the fact that I just, I just, I fell for you. It's something about the way you do things. I, you know, I could actually honestly see myself being with you. If this stuff never happened, we would probably be together right now. Really? Yes. Thomas, the situation, you had me kidnapped and ransomed for blackmail money. And then you work for someone. Even if what I felt for you was real, how could I ever trust you again? You have to give me an opportunity to prove myself to you. The real me. I'm not violent. If I was, why didn't I harm Danielle when her identity was revealed? I let her go. I didn't mean for that to happen. Even when I was torturing and beating her. I said I did not want to do this. I never intended for anyone to be hurt. I understand that you didn't want to hurt her or me, but you work for someone who wants to hurt me and Ray. <laughs> yes, but I don't work for them anymore. I worked for them. Mm -hmm. When I set Danielle free, I was let go. I have nothing. That's why I'm here asking for your help. I need your help. I have nothing. Nothing. You are the only thing in this world that I have. How can I help you? How can I possibly do that without damaging? 
in my relationship with Ray and my friends. What are you asking me to do? You gotta give me an opportunity to show you who I really am. I I'm gonna need to stay here in your condo for a while. I, I, I gotta get my stuff back. All my money is taken. My accounts, they're frozen. I have my passport and I have a little bit of cash at my place. But it's being watched. They have people staged there to watch to try to catch me. So I need to stay here for a while just until I can devise a plan to be able to get in, get my stuff, and get out without being on the scene. Okay, um... I cannot let you stay here. Look, I cannot get involved in this mess. I can't. I, I really can't. I need your help. I need your help. You're all I got. I don't have anyone else. Give me an opportunity to show you who I really am. I'm not a violent person. Uh -huh. I never intended to hurt you or Danielle. Okay, um, all right. I will let you stay and stay there for a week, but you're gonna have to figure out a way to get your things and, and get out of town. All right. um, you need to stay invisible. Nobody cannot see you. My neighbors will be watching our house, so if they see you, they're going to call me and the police. Okay. okay. <laughs> and I'll take my condo off the market so they won't show my okay. part right. to anybody. I will stay in this. And thank you. And you won't regret this. Just allow me to show you who I am. some um, food and things that you're going to need to live here for the week. And um, I need to get back home before Ray calls and um, before he comes over here. So I got to go. Okay. Thank you. You will never regret this. Sir, sir, wake up! <clears throat> wake up! I want you to go. I want you to get in your car. I want you to get out of here as fast as you can. Understand? You know what? No, wait, wait, wait. wait. I got your ID. I know where you live. I want you to get as far away from here as possible. And if I ever hear of you contacting the police or talking to somebody else, I'm going to send my associates over to your house and they're going to do business with you, Erica, Joy, Little Debbie, and Phil Jr. So get the heck out of here and I don't ever want to see you again. You understand? You understand? Fiance, some love and attention. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Baby, you alright? Mm -hmm. How the buyer? The buyer? 
Yeah, the buyer. You just went to the condo. The buyer. Oh. Oh, yeah. You are? <laughs> yeah, the buyer. <laughs> okay, I'm feeling okay. I am. I guess I was just thinking about something. Okay. Um, the buyer, yeah, um, she made an offer. So I'm going to take the condo off the market while she... No, I'll go over her offer. I mean, Yay. <laughs> yes, you stuck in the gaze. There's something to celebrate yeah. about. Yeah. Hey, I'm going to toast to that. Damn, now we can focus on us being together. Don't yeah. got to worry about double mortgages. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Well, I don't have the wine, but I wanted to toast to the best future wife I have in the world. Baby. Okay, I'm, I'm not the best. I just feel like... Um, Making love? <laughs> yes. Me too. How about we take a shower together today? <laughs> we haven't done that in a while. Babe, I already took a shower. <laughs> no, but babe, come on. I just wanted to explore you in a different way tonight. Is that okay? You know anything for you. Okay. Mm. Oh. I'm gonna get it ready, alright? Okay. Make me regret this. I'm supposed to even Justice, I'm so sorry I wasn't paying attention to your needs. Please forgive me. It's cool. I know how things get more complicated, especially after the end of What? Who you telling me? Look, I do everything I can in my power for my son. I just don't want to deal with his mom. Well, I wasn't going to bring it up, but since you mentioned it, what's going on? Hey, it's, it's a little complicated, but I'm really bad. Can I get this is okay. Get whatever you want. And can I have a shot of Henny, please? Justice. Justice. You never, ever have to ask me if it's okay. Get what you want. I got it. You got it. So, we do communicate through text and through her mom. I haven't seen her. And frankly, I really don't want to see her anymore. The last time that I talked to her, I made it very clear that this is over. I'm done with her. Well, I heard that she's talking to someone else. Really? Well, good for her. As a matter of fact, I hope she's not cheating on him. The only good, worthy thing that came out of that woman was James. I love my son. You know, since I left that church and got back to my job, I am happy and life is good for me. What is it that you do exactly? I work for this transportation company and I, I move some shipping around internationally for them. Okay, um, that's pretty interesting. Is it? Are you traveling? It does. Um, depending on what state that I'm moving the product in. But, um, I'm headed to Miami tonight. You should come with me. Maybe I will. Maybe you should. <laughs> so for that. Okay. Uh, you smell good. Yeah, you look pretty good. Oh, it's really nice. Not as delicious. Not as delicious as you. <laughs> you know, Justice, what's going on between you and your sisters? Are they still getting on your damn nerves? Yes, they are. Listen, I'm just trying to save up enough money so I can move out. I just want a new place I can afford. You know what? I'm not going to help you out with that. 
Matter of fact, what about you come moving with me? Um, no. What? I don't think that you're ready for that, and I'm not either. But listen, if my sister can get on my nerves, I might take it on my You should take me over now. Matter of fact, I'm going to leave the key underneath the mat. So, Justice, this is one of my clients. I really have to take this. Um, I hate to end our date so soon, but you think maybe we can pick up on this later on tonight? You sure? Yeah, yeah. How about this? Let me take care of my client. When I get done with the client, I'll come back and pick you up. And I'll bring you back to my house and we'll finish that thing. Okay, it's better than staying at home. Yeah, let's go to that. How did you find me? It is not important, but 
and all that is is that we need to get you out of here because you are somebody recognizing you. I don't care what people think. Isn't that too long for you? I am my own man. Why do you even care? You probably knew Rachel was cheating on No, I didn't. But when I did find out, I told her to end it before she loses you. Well, she surely didn't listen to you, huh? Yeah. It's too long to just walk away like this. Rachel loves you, and she needs your forgiveness. So, no, mm, I can't, nope, can't do that. She's hurt me too many times for that. Awesome, my child. I just don't feel like I have anything worth saving. Yeah, I'm good. Hey, here's, here's my money. Thanks for the talk. Oh.